We're on the only purple map in BTD6 using only purple towers. Let's go ahead and drop down Azili while you drop a like on this video because that was awesome. All right, there's only one rule besides subscribing from the channel. Is that, and that is I can only upgrade a tower or put down a tower when I have enough money to upgrade it and make him purple. That's it. Other than that, everything's free game. So I think we can count the alchemist as purple, right? I mean, obviously he's a monkey, so he's brown, but like the, the code is purple. All right, let's drop down an alchemist right here. This will help do a little bit more damage. Plus he has the, uh, the whatever you, whatever it's called, like the fire tick damage so i don't know maybe it'll help a little bit i'll probably oh i can't get up an acid pool now that i think about it that's yeah that's over 1200 or that's almost 1200 dollars. it's freaking expensive maybe larger potions yeah that doesn't change his code at all oh we're already leaking <laughs> no all right what if i just put down another alchemist i think surely yeah that's solving our problems pretty well now i'm gonna keep it a buck there's really just not that many early game towers and playing on an advanced map on a hard mode this is hard but i think i can beat it i think i can make it at least around 100 and if i don't get it on my first attempt ladies and gentlemen i will be getting it and by the end of this video we are going to reign over btd6 with only purple balloons i don't have a purple shirt but i got blue this is close enough all right we can get crossbow so you know what i think i'm gonna restart this because crossbow has the purple thing over his eyes i can almost afford it right away actually so maybe if i just leak the first round i could just on the second round get up another or get up our first crossbow let's try it. okay beautiful beautiful we've got a freaking crossbow this should be a much better start than azili freaking azili bro i don't know who's using azili if you're not going super late game but let's go ahead and put her down in a second there we go i believe she hits camo i don't know if not i know she hits lead so that's something so we've got this guy down we can go for sharp shots but not for quick shots because that changes the bandana or whatever it's covering his eyes that's a blindfold it's not even a bandana we can change uh sharp shots so we can get razor sharp shots but i'm not gonna get the the second one i'm not gonna get razor i'm just gonna get normal sharp shots and i'm gonna oops i should have sold that i can't buy it until i can get it purple okay now i can buy it i can put him down and we can go for okay okay never mind now i can put him down and then we can go for a crossbow there we go we got two crossbows on the board let's go for razor sharp shots because that only changes the tail and that doesn't matter all right so we got two two zero three dart monkeys that's a good start and azili that's not even the worst honestly i feel like this is something all right now let's think i could go for a glaive ricochet that'd be kind of clutch i'm not allowed bomb not allowed tag not allowed ice uh, i'm allowed corrosive glue so yippee i'm allowed large caliber on the sniper not allowed sub not allowed boat not allowed ace allowed apache prime out of all towers not allowed mortar i'm allowed the the these three i'm allowed bottom path wizard except for necromancer i'm allowed anything with plasma blast on it so like any tier two and robo monkey and tech terror no ninjas i'm allowed the alchemists that are purple and then some other stuff i don't know doesn't matter oh wait no 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 i could go for spike storm with uh bigger stacks i can't get white out spikes but bigger stacks could be cool i just lost a lot of health uh-oh okay let's um what the heck okay can i put anything on this desk here yeah i can remove for 250 let's go ahead and put up a uh, large caliber here now i believe if i go for shrapnel shot that won't affect anything yeah i mean it made it a little yellow but whatever that shrapnel shot should be pretty important here because he just does a lot of damage i I think a necromancer would also be kind of amazing here and intense magic or monkey sense no it's guided magic but i'm fine with getting guided magic because now i have shimmer can i get arcane blast on it oh i can it makes him even more purple look at that all right i want necromancer uh unpopped army i want that one so let's get that up here and that should have two courses of balloons somewhere i don't know where it is i don't see any ghost balloons what's happening oh he just doesn't have anything in his graveyard because i don't have him on wall of fire wait maybe i should sell and go for wall of fire oh but this doesn't look purple wait is wall of fire purple it's red uh, dude oh and now he's permanently fireball i'm getting freaking scammed all right so maybe i don't want that what do i want i can get this i can get a red hot rings i can't get more glaives so i can just get up like another one if i want it uh this isn't good maybe i can save up for a sharpshooter because he's still dark purple yeah now i've got enough to i don't know go for a freaking crossbow here come on dude oh wait sniper might have it sniper might have it yes okay we didn't even leak on the moab that's actually huge okay this is not as bad as i thought it was gonna be i don't know how i'm gonna get these lives back up to 100 and beyond but uh maybe we'll find a way someday for now let's just get up another sniper a 2-2 sniper just to help out on the field 
I can do- Oh, I can get two more up here. That's huge. All right, you know, we're just gonna flood the map in as many two twos as we can get with full range because that is a fantastic thing to do. Can I fit more than two on a desk? I swear- I feel like I can. I really feel like I can, but I don't think we're putting a freaking sniper there. All right, well, let's get another sharpshooter up because we've got the money. We'll get three of them up, uh, all of them with razor sharp shots. Now, I wonder- Okay, you can't clear these bottom ones, it doesn't seem. What is this? What is, what is this guy flinching for? I feel like they flinch for a reason, but now we've got the Moab out. I should put these guys on strong. What am I doing? All right, we need something with a little more oomph to it, you know? A Hydro Rocket Pods would actually be pretty good. I have no idea where I'm gonna put something like that. Maybe just here? I could put one on each side. I think that'd be kind of cool. So let's lock this over here and go for Hydro Rocket Pods. I believe I can go for whatever cross path I want. Uh, focus firing should be better and Laser Shock should be better. So this isn't that bad, right? He's seen across this entire thing. Um, although, yeah, his things are exploding on this wall right here. So he's only doing half the damage I thought he would be. Because it says- Oh, wait, no, it's not. What? What just happened? Oh, is that how this works? Wait, sometimes this is open and sometimes it's fire. Oh, and then these turn- Oh. Dude, 57 rounds in, I didn't even realize this crap. Okay, well, let's go for um another uh, Hydro Rocket Pods. Target him right over there. You know, I was thinking about doing only purple balloons too, but then it would only be purple balloons and BAD. So I, I think I'm good on that. I think I'll hold off. I'll just do normal rounds. Ooh, round 60. Uh-oh, that's death, ain't it? Uh, yep, that's death. Uh, uh, that's, that's not death, but it's too close. I think I can micro that a little bit better. So if I do something like this and then just immediately start shooting at everything, Thing. And maybe even if I do a Moab Hex here or whatever that was. Oh my goodness, it didn't even pop children. Okay, that was OP. It's like Benjamin's thing, I think. All right, but I still need some more damage. So I'm, I'm not really sure what to get here. If I could, I'd save up for Prince of Darkness and, you know, things would be nice and, and breezy. But I don't know about all of that. And I, don't, I can't put these guys on the railing, which is kind of silly. Yeah, I feel like I, this guy should fit on the railing. Ooh, I can go for a Spike Storm. Actually, that might be the play here if I can fit one in up top. If not, I might, I don't know, just cry i can't fit one at the top all right well that's a bummer um uh oh yeah that's death okay okay it's just gonna whatever do i use my free continue i've never continued on this freaking account before all right well i need a good way to be able to destroy round 63 glaive lord could be fun don't think I can afford it. We can double Rocket Storm, but I don't want to rely on abilities. Honestly, it might just be down to Glaive Ricochet spam, which sucks. All right, that's about as much as I can get here. I Oh yeah, we're good, we're good. Okay, beautiful. And we'll never have a problem again, right? Look at that, it's magical, we're winning. But I don't know, I feel like I need a super monkey somewhere, but I've got nowhere to put one. I think there's not actually a single spot to put a super monkey besides on the cabinets, which kind of really sucks. Although if I could get up a tech terror, that's definitely worth more than two, two, zero uh, snipers. So let's sell this, sell this, put a super monkey right, um, right here. We want to get it in as much of a crevice as we can. Go for plasma blast. And now we are beautiful. This guy should do a good amount of damage. And I think I can sell, sell and go for a plasma blast just like a normal plasma blast yeah there we go and i can start working my way up onto a uh, a robo monkey we're on round 78 which means i'm actually beating this a little bit faster than i thought i would but i still have to get to round 100 and that is kind of the hard part here oh okay i guess 78 is the hard part um i don't think it takes that much i think i just need to untarget these guys and i don't know maybe use a rocket storm if i can afford one. Up, oh, nope i didn't even need it okay oh there it is uh oh okay yeah well i completely didn't use that correctly Man, you know what? D delete this, delete this, delete this. I need a freaking Glaive Lord, bro. What am I doing? This should be able to handle even the right side of this, right? Because yeah, this still goes through this line. Everything ends up going through this line. So the Glaive Lord here is just going to be overpowered. Uh, that said, I still probably want a Super Monkey here. I should be good against round 80. Glaive Lord OP. Yeah, let's freaking go. I did not get my money back at all, but let's make it to round 100 though, because that's the real challenge. Go against the real purple balloon. Well, I mean, it even if, if I could, I'd go up to around 140. I don't know if that's possible yet. But over here, I think I'm going to put down a spike factory. I think I'm going to put down a little uh, spike storm because this should help do a lot of damage. And it has that global range that we're kind of needing right about now. We just lost half our health to what? I don't even know. I might put down. Can I put down a spike factory here? No, you're freaking kidding me. That's so fits there. What's even the point of an exit of a map if I can't put a freaking spike factory there? Uh oh, OK, clutch. Thank you. Ooh, an MA. D would be awesome, but I don't know if I'm going to be able to afford that one. Oh, I died. Okay. Yay, more money.
Omni! Okay, what did I die to? Why do I always die? It's always the stupid stuff that I just end up dying to. Okay, let's get Robo Monkey. I don't think we need Tech Terror. Oh, no. Okay, yeah. Ah, that's not good. That's not good at all. We're gonna leak a whole DDT. Is Can I put an Apache up here? Because if I can get an Apache Prime, that might be cool. Nope. Okay. Um, Carpet of Spikes, maybe? I don't know if this will even do the damage to the DDTs, though. No, it won't. It won't do the damage to the DDTs because it doesn't have white-hot spikes. I could get Prince of Darkness, actually. That wouldn't be a bad idea. All right, let's try to get a pod right here. Um, we'll just put it... Okay, I need another thousand dollars. I'll sell one of these guys. Okay, I'll sell two of these guys. Go for a POD, and now I can actually put down Wall of Fire, and now he's effective. And I still died. What did I die to? A, a red balloon? Okay, a ceramic. Fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. And I don't even die the next time. I don't know what changed. Where are these guys' balloons? Where... Why is he getting no graveyard anything? Is he just broken on this map? I feel like I'm being scammed here. I ordered a freaking wall of fire. Does this guy do wall of fire? He does wall of fire, so why can't you do wall of fire? Oh, he can do wall of fire. So what is he doing? Where's the freaking graveyard? All right, I I'm actually being hacked. I'm being freaking hacked. All right, well, screw that idea. Prince of Darkness is doo-doo right now. Freaking the one time I need him, bro. I could go for a shimmer and just get up like a um uh, 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 century champion guy. I mean, I should get up a shimmer either way because, uh, you know, camos. I don't even know. Maybe we can go for a carpet of spikes. No, that's a bad idea. Why would I go for a carpet of spikes? I shouldn't even be doing that because I need to be DDT. So what's going to be DDTs? Apache Prime is impossible, so I picked the perfect map for this. MAD is way too expensive. Although maybe I can go for MAD. Hold up. Wait, dudes, we're going to try this out. We're going to sell this this and um i still need to spend six thousand and now i need another 25 because the way i see it the glaive lord's gonna be able to wipe out any normal like tiny baby balloon right so if i sell everything else and i go for are you kidding me okay i need a hundred bucks i think i can generate a hundred dollars i don't need to sell something else for that right okay mad right there and now the glaive lord oh my goodness i'm lagging again now yeah i should be able to just wipe out the balloons the normal balloons with the mad if i can stop lagging oh no but now Oh, no. Um, yeah, that's not good. I mean, he can still clutch it, but, like, I'd rather him not have to. Let's see, if I put some glaive ricochets here, I don't know, maybe these guys will do something? No, we're so close, but we're gonna die. I wish I would have put this freaking glaive lord a little more, like, I don't know, to the right. I don't know if there's much chance of that happening anymore, but I will put a guard down at the bottom. I don't know, maybe he'll do a little bit of extra damage. Yeah, he popped it into a zebra and then into nothing, so maybe we won't die. Okay, we're just gonna die there. Freaking tired of this game. I want to go home. All right, hopefully let's sell and let's sell and let's just get this guy to, okay. Oh, wait, okay, that's perfect. There we go. So he's got rings on both sides now. So now if we press four here, that's going to activate this guy's ability, make him a little bit stronger and we should live, right? We should live. We should live. We should live. We should live. I just want to live. All right, hear me out. What if we get a little support guy with the acidic mi mixture dip because that buffs Moabs, right? Yeah, more damage to ceramics and Moabs. And now maybe perhaps, oh my goodness, we beat it. I don't know if we're beating this though. I'll keep it a buck. This is kind of scaring me. Oh, oh, that's a blue. Okay, okay, okay. Come on. Okay, holy crap. We're actually not dying here. We might live. Some would say that is the opposite of dying. All right, let's... I do want to go for Shimmer, though, because Shimmer is a very, very awesome idea. Mostly so that I can put down a couple supers, and this guy can do a little bit of extra damage to what he needs to do damage to. So, yeah, for around, like, 97 and hopefully 98, this guy should be super duper awesome awesome. Don't even need to use any abilities. Don't even... Okay, maybe we needed to use a few abilities. All right, so what if we Moab Hex here so that it doesn't spawn children balloons? Okay, perfect, because I wanted to save the MAD ability for round 98, which uh, should be perfect, right? Nope. Okay, we just leaked a whole fortified ceramic and somehow live. That's even more impressive. All right, so hear me out. We do this and then we just do whatever Azili's abilities are. And this way we don't die, right? Because the Glaive Lord is so OP that it's going to hit all the balloons that go down over here and we should be absolutely... Come on, dude! All right, well, first, I think we're going to sell these two because they're just kind of useless to us. And I mean, uh, at this point, because I have the wizard here, I'm 
might just sell the alchemists too. <sighs> I've got $10,000 to play around with. That is not a lot, ladies and gentlemen, but it should be enough for a spike storm. It should be. It isn't, but I believe it should be in my, in my heart of hearts. All right, let's get spike storm now. We'll get bigger stacks as well. Hopefully this is okay. Perfect. There we go. We'll go ahead and Moab hex as well. I don't know what we Moab hex, but we did it to something and holy crap, the crowd goes wild because he beat round 98. This freaking map would be a struggle if I wasn't using only purple towers. Is there anywhere else on this map I could physically put a freaking uh, uh, spike factory? That's the, oh, that's the BAD. Uh-oh. Okay, I gotta think smart here. What do we even get? What do we get here? Can I beat it without anything else? Can I use, wait, can I use the Moab hex on the BAD? Wait, if so, then Azili's OP for this, right? Oh, oh, dude. Dude, she just made it not spawn any children. Holy crap, we just won. Just like freaking that. And then we lost just like that. 